So take a few moments to relax the breath and clear the mind. We know from previous studies that practitioners may use meditation to become more creative. Indeed, Stevie Jobs arguably one of the most creative minds of our time, dedicated his life to Zen Buddhist meditation practice. However, is it necessary to be a practitioner to become more creative through meditation? Many people, such as animals, would like to improve their creativity, but have never meditated before, right, animal? Hmm, meditation... Hmm... No. Ah, I'm making noise. Ah, yeah. ah. At the University of Leiden, we investigated whether and how much practice is necessary to obtain meditation effects on creativity, and whether this effect is due to a trait of being an individual interested in meditation, a state ad hoc induced by meditation, or both. <laughs> We compared, on a task related to divergent thinking, two groups of people. One group of practitioners, such as Steve Jobs was, and one group of novices, who has never meditated before, such as Animal. Uh, yeah. Both groups were tested twice. Before the creativity tasks, they did one time the open monitoring meditation, in which they were open to all the thoughts and sensations experienced. The other time, they did instead the focus attention meditation, in which they have to focus on a particular thought or object. We found that after open monitoring, but not focus attention meditation, not only practitioners, but also novices were better in generating new ideas. Okay, animal, for this divergent thinking task, you have to think about the possible uses of this So yes, we believe that it's not the amount of practice, but the state that meditation puts you in that makes you more creative. Open monitoring meditation is an easy way to enhance your divergent thinking that may lead to an increment of efficiency and productivity, besides promoting individual well-being. <laughs>